Bernard Tobin here at the Fire and Progress Show, back with uh, George Rigdon from uh, New Holland. This time, we're looking at the Roll Belt 560 Specialty Crop Plus. Yes, sir. Tell us about it. So this is kind of new. We launched this midway through model year 2019, but it's essentially building off of the Roll Belt 560 round baler that we had before, which was a specialty crop. So the Plus gives us a few more unique features in this baler really kind of dialed in for those who want to bale anything from dry hay to higher moisture. So what we've done is essentially been changes inside the bale chamber. One of those changes being dual follower rolls, and one of those is a spiraled roll as well. Then up top on the back, we have a rubber coated spiral back wrap roll. And on the back, on the bottom side of the tailgate, there are tailgate chopping rolls. So what's that do for a producer? Really, it helps to make sure that there's no crop or debris that accumulates on the rolls or on the belts so you can bale in those higher moisture um, conditions. Now, you also mentioned that, you know, moisture management is so important. You've got factory moisture sensors here. We do, Bernard. So that's, that's another new thing that was introduced partway through model year 2019. A really nice system. It's factory installed. Inside the bale chamber, the two infeed discs have carriage bolts that send an electrical current throughout the bale as it's forming. There's moisture content that's sensed every second roughly and displayed live in your New Holland either Bale Command 2 Plus monitor or on an IntelliView 4 monitor. So you have real-time moisture sensing capability in this baler. And at the end, when that bale is fully wrapped, fully complete, it'll give you an average bale moisture content level as well. And it ranges, it'll sense from 7% moisture all the way up to 60% moisture. So quite a range there. Now you mentioned that I guess the package all comes together um, with the in-cab density control. It does, yeah. So, so again, kind of making things more simple and intuitive for the operator, you can change and vary your density from inside the tractor. So basically through the monitor, and again, whether it's a Bale Command 2 or whether it's the IntelliView monitor, you have the ability to go in and vary not only the overall bale density, but also the core density of that bale. So you can really make a nice package for your operation, and you've got that nice, intuitive, simple, easy operation there with having that in-cab bale density control. Final question, George. Availability, when are growers going to be able to get their hands on it? So Specialty Crop Plus, we're taking orders for now. The plant in New Holland, Pennsylvania is going to be building these balers here starting in September. So we'll have stuff showing up on dealer lots probably late quarter three, early quarter four of 2019. Awesome. Hey, sir, uh, always great to chat with you. Thanks for your time. Thank you, Bernard. I appreciate it.